maybe when it was first built in those dollars, um, uh, thousand dollars, perhaps? <laughs> it cost a fortune, and it cost a dollar. What? Wow. <laughs> this thing was bought for one dollar. Uh, <laughs> what? It is very expensive. What do you mean, wow? <laughs> <laughs> it cost an arm and a leg back in the day. Uh -huh. <laughs> they got it for a dollar from the historic society of Bottle Creek. What? And it just moved here in 1998. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> wow. So, you know, uh, Joseph Betts. Who is Joseph Betts? I told you about that man a couple of minutes ago. He was a captain, yeah. You caught that point. Yes. Mm -hmm. And he was one of the founders of this church, right? Yes. There were three founders. Mm -hmm. So one of them was Joseph Bates. Yes. And mm -hmm. guess what? Guess what he did? He heard that in Battle Creek, there are no, there are no seven Adventists. Mm -hmm. So he asked the Lord. The Lord said, hey, go to Battle Creek. We need some people there. Mm -hmm. So he says, well, okay, let's go. He goes to the uh, postmaster. Anybody can tell me what postmaster is? Yeah, well, letter. Letter. Yeah. Letter. Dealing with letter. Person at a post office, right? <laughs> at the post office, the top person. Mm -hmm. So he comes to Battle Creek and he goes to the post office and he asks the, the, the postmaster, he says, Hey man, I came here and uh, trying to convert some people. And you know what that man recommended? He said, Go to the the hell the Hewitt. Is that is that how you say Hewitt? The last name. How, how do you how do you pronounce this? Hewitt. Hewitt. Mm -hmm. Okay. He says that is the most honest man in the town. Hmm. Okay. So he comes to the Hewitt in 1852, and he visited them, and they accepted that message ready. He told them, "Oh, this is the Sabbath. God says this and that, those and those." So mm -hmm. he said, okay, I accept this. So the Hewitt family became the first converts in this battle creek. Wow. Wow. And look at the things that we have here. Very old stuff, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. This is for the kids so that they can, when they sleep, we can rock them back and forth. Uh -huh. Yeah, here, and just back them. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's where the adults slept, I believe. Wow. They had to iron some clothes with that. Spinning wheel. Mm -hmm. Is that ironing board? board? Yeah, that's for ironing clothes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Wow, look at this old style. Oh, look at this. The one then. Blue bins for. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, by the Oh, wow. What's the use of this? Thing? Punch up motor, something. Yeah, it's a motor and pestle. So ah. you put something, let's say ginger, uh, and you uh -huh. crush it. Oh, uh -huh. I see. Waffle iron. Maybe they used to have waffles back in the day. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, make pancake. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Yeah. You know, Hewitt's, one well, of the most interesting thing is they have never never been part of the, the Adventist mm -hmm. idea or the Millerite thing, mm -hmm. but they were they were honest. Mm -hmm. And he came and he talked to them. He said, oh, man, you people, God says this, and uh, so I want you to, to listen to me. Mm -hmm. They accepted it right away. Wow. And it was a major shift because there was no Adventist in Bible Creek, and Bible Creek was to be the center of Adventism mm -hmm. in a couple of years.